Hello, wonderful YouTube. It's Alex. Uh, today, um, you know what? Uh, got a story to tell you guys. It's basically my New Year's Eve, New Year's Day, and today's story all roped into one video. So let's open up about 6:30 Thursday night. I arrive at my friend's house, and we we had plans to have an awesome New Year's Eve, and we did. It was actually, in my opinion, very fun. Um. And we hung out, we, you know, except till midnight. We played Minecraft, Bed Wars. It was all fun. Then, uh, well, midnight comes, and I try to order the new uh, police station set. Didn't work. It took, like, 30 minutes. I hadn't even gotten past the put-in-your-information page before. It didn't even verify. It was very disappointing. But I don't blame Lego. I really don't. Anyways, uh, then, so now we wake up here. For the real juiciest bit of the story. The Lego store raid. The raid I've been talking about for months. Or a month. Wake up at 7.30. Okay. I had set three alarms. And I didn't eat all of them. It was good. But then, you know. Uh, so I get ready to go. And all is swell. You know. Dad's getting up. We're on, when we, we leave the house. Okay. And there's no one on the road. I thought, well, it's Brexel Road. Oh. Uh, well, yeah, you get the idea. Anyway, the road's empty. Uh, and it was empty. and I just didn't really care. I was like, oh, well, maybe because, you know, state highways aren't very busy normally. So, major. And then, you know, we got on the highway also empty. The highway's completely empty. Uh, and it was, uh, very, very eerie just driving down an empty interstate that was literally, like, no one on it. It was scary. Then we arrived at the mall 15 minutes early. We were ahead of schedule the entire time, and honestly, I was surprised. So we get there, and the mall wasn't open, so we had to wait in our car for, like, 15 minutes. No big deal. We get in the store. I walk up. I'm the third in line for the Lego store. I'm like, what? This is outrageous. It's unfair. So I'm waiting. And the kid in front of me, we talk. Uh, he was also there for the police station. And he had waited. He was second in line. A couple. There was a couple in front of the line. They were only there for some Mickey Mouse mosaic. It was amazing. So I waited in line for an hour. Doors open. I rush in. I grab the first building off one of the... They had two different spots. They had. I grabbed the first one off the shelf, basically. It was amazing. I got two promotional sets. I got to shout out to the cashier for this. I got the the teal convertible that was supposed to come with this, the gift of purchase, eighty five and above. And then there was another one from last month that they had it surplus of, and I got it. So honestly, it was a really sweet deal. I got basically two hundred forty dollars worth of Lego for two hundred fifteen dollars sixty four cents. Pretty sweet. Tonight I leave and come back home? And I built it. It took five hours. I started around 11.30. I had to eat some breakfast. Or not really breakfast. It was breakfast part two. And took I took a little bit of a rest. Then started building the set. I finished it at like 4.30. It was it's a big set. And then, you know, I kind of just spent the rest of my New Year's Day just doing things. And then watching the Ohio State game. It was pretty cool. Today was the day that my cousins came up. And that was the scary day. Because, uh. They tend to, they have broken my Legos in the past, so, uh, it was, it was interesting, and then, you know, we, I really wanted to actually add a diner in the police station all day, because I didn't do it yesterday, because I was at my mom's house, I built the station at my mom's house, I didn't do it, I was very upset with myself, I couldn't do it all day, and then when I leave, I finally got to do it, now the cousins, we really didn't do much, we played games, I had lightsaber duel my younger cousin, He's like five. It was awesome. We we did gifts exchange. It's all good. They only left about an hour ago. Yeah, like just about an hour ago now. But it was overall really fun. Now I can show you guys my city. Now I had to remove the roads because of table constraints. But uh, the roads are back there. Don't worry. I didn't get rid of them. So now you can see I added the diner over here which is uh, in the shadows of the corner garage. But it, it fits in. It looks really good. So it's not like I put it next to, like, a really bad-looking building. But then, you know, I got the the long street. And then over here, we've got the police station. 
and oh yeah, and the teal convertible. Uh, really cool. Look on it head on. You can't even see the side building because of the shadow. There's actually a billboard there. Uh, I think you guys might have known that. But anyways, I have plans to expand this table a bit, add the road, and uh, then call it a day. But anyways, if you guys like like this video, please comment, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll, I'll see you guys later. Uh, oh, actually, if you go out this far, comment police below. See you guys.